All right, now we're going to cut our pumpkin cheesecake latte soap. So this has pumpkin cheesecake fragrance as well as a coffee fragrance. And I'm just going to take the end off. still just a little bit soft. Pull this in. So it has some orange pigment, pigment running through it as well as white And I used a brown pigment for the brown color. And I know that the pumpkin cheesecake fragrance has a lot of vanillin in it, so it will get darker. Oh, that one's pretty. Almost looks like it's got a heart in it. All things pumpkin-y for the fall. I'm trying to get all of my fall things, my fall soaps and other products made. I do have a craft show in October. And I'm trying to get ahead of things. That orange in there is very faint. I didn't put very much at all. It was just a little bit of orange. I know around Christmas time, I made a peppermint espresso. So I thought maybe this one would be nice for the fall. In the past, I've done fancy fall soaps, and they have not been that popular. I was under the impression that they would sell, and they haven't, so I'm not going all out this year. I do have a pumpkin pie fragrance. I think it's actually called homemade pumpkin pie. And last year I made a bunch of little pie slices. And if you notice, my hand is taped. I cut my finger. So that's why I'm using this cutter instead of my 12 bar cutter, because this one, I don't want to actually put much weight on my hand right now. It's been a couple days since I cut my finger and it was right on the knuckle. So I taped my little finger to the other one so that I would not bend my knuckle and cause it to pop open. Should I have gone to the emergency room and had it stitched? Mm -hmm. When we lived in Africa, we had a book called Where There Is No Doctor because we were in a village about nine hours from the capital city of Botswana. And finding a doctor was not easy. So my precious hubby would use that book and seek to 
work on all little cracks and problems in the best way we could. And he would use the butterfly band-aid method, but he would create his own butterfly band-aids. Ooh, I like that one. That's pretty. So when I did this on Friday, I decided that I, oh my, look at that one. Woo! But that's an end. I decided I was going to just try the where there is no doctor method. And I did. And we will see how it turns out. Those are my pumpkin cheesecake latte bars.